raw material, mate. Not over land now. Raw materials, mate. What causes this huge drain on raw materials? And what causes all the pollution, all the junk in the water and the air? One word answer. Shopping! The world is being destroyed by women and men can't stop them. But who gets the blame? Men do. <laughs> Why? Because we're weak and it is our people. We should bring women back under control and stop them shopping. And then we can save the world and have no more wars. Only small ones, I think. <laughs> what chance have men got of stopping women shopping? That will show you what the power balance is all about. Who runs the world? Should, should men go fishing all the time and hunting? They aren't allowed to by their wives. <laughs> now, we are programmed to go hunting and fishing for 100,000 years of hunting and Women spent the same time not hunting and fishing, but gathering, which is another version of shopping. <laughs> Women indulge their instincts at all times. Men are never allowed to be men. Never! Behave like a man, and every school teacher and every social worker descends them like a ton of bricks. You are castrated from the very earliest years, and all your life you need to keep your balls well hidden or they cut off. <laughs> Women hate men, but not as much as men that hate men. They really do hate men. Men that hate men are the problem of the world, and they're everywhere. And if you don't love men, what do you love? Mammy, the wife, the girl. You do anything to please a bloody woman, except grow up! Now, for 35 years, all men are going to be abused by women. They'll be rude to us, they'll insult us, they'll outsmart us, fair enough. But there comes a time when men want to get out from under all this bullshit and rubbish, and it's their turn to abuse women! And there is no pleasure greater on earth than abusing women the right way. Humorous, ironic, and they can't do a damn thing about it. They love to, but they have to use men to do that. And those men dare do it. Because oh, I'm a fearsome enemy. Never invited to speak at any school. Never invited to speak at university. No one ever records what I say. No meetings are held. What I say is so dangerous. Because it's bloody true, it's the trouble. And they don't want the truth. They want spin.